the subcommittee. Thank you. Thank you. <coughs> um, all right. So last but not least, maybe. Thank you, staff. I, I, I want really to, to mention the mandatory mediation and the just cause. This is, a, this is a thorny issue, and I think that's the reason why it's been hard for the supervisors and the subcommittee to really grapple with it. It's been on that table for a long time, and I think we need to bring that forward, and we need to say we either want to do this under these conditions or recommend to us that we don't. But I think it's really time to look at that, especially when we see what's happening and, and the people that are hurting uh, in this county. Um, very supportive of the revaluation of the housing overlay. It, people who've said the lack of supply is, is what's really at, the, at the, the, the bottom of the problem. Well, that, this housing overlay has got to be changed so that we can look at providing new affordable housing in this county. And I think we've got to be strong enough when there is a proposal for affordable housing that we all come and stand up and say this is the right thing to do. It's, uh, it's trauma time and, and we need to be very, very serious um, about this issue. Um, and um, certainly I, I support uh, uh, adding a staff person. Um, I think uh, the workshop for the housing overlay is the next step and I think that's a great idea. Um, and um, I think that's, um, yes, I, I wrote down the 5%. That's still a lot when you're a tenant, but <laughs> at least if it's capped, that's better than nothing. So I want to thank I want to thank everyone who came here, everyone who who stayed and gave your thoughts. It we heard it, and it was powerful what we heard. So.